This Pokemon box right here, the Cyrus Premium Tournament Collection box, is going to be a must-have product for a lot of Pokemon players out there. Because of this box, I'll be able to have my first ever full art copy of Boss's Orders, which I can use in my competitive Pokemon card game, so I'm excited for that. Now, if you don't know, Cyrus is the leader of Team Galactic, and I actually have something in common with him. I am the same age as Cyrus. Cyrus is the age of 27. With that said, the common question of the day is, who is your favorite villain in the Pokemon franchise. I think Giovanni is my favorite villain, you could say. So comment down below your favorite villain. And let's turn this around and read the little blurb. Team Galactic's brooding leader is a master manipulator, disrupting your opponent's finely tuned plans with his ruthless boss's order. You can make Cyrus's scheming a part of your own strategy with his full playset of the boss's order supporter card that outfit your deck with the protective sleeves and deck box that match. You'll also find tournament legal dice and other essential gameplay accessories, plus a stack of Pokemon TCG booster packs to give you even more options in battle. I picked this up from Manta Trading. If you guys want to shop with Manta Trading, you guys can use code SneakerTalkTCG to get 5% off. Link down below. Boss's Orders, you guys probably know, is, is one of the best cards in the game. And if you want to full art Boss's Orders with like Giovanni on the cover from Rebel Clash, that is an expensive, expensive, uh, <laughs> expensive thing to buy. But now we have a, uh, a new full art version, which you can just buy with these boxes, which is very, very handy. It's nice to start things off. Black and yellow, I like it. Very easy to read the numbers. The deck box here is really nice too. We got Gyarados, we got Honchkrow. So pretty nice deck box here. Here's a look at the sleeves that come with it. Again, these sleeves are just like the Elite Trainer boxes. So they're cool to look at, but when it comes to, when it comes to actually playing them practicality wise, they don't shuffle, they don't feel very, very good. They're very easy to break. So uh, we're gonna do a giveaway for these actually. So just answer the common question of the day and one person who hits that like button and then comments down below and is subscribed. We'll get these. We got the boss's orders card. So it's not the exact same art. I kind of wish it did have like the Gyarados and Honchkrow on it, but we have the open mouth YouTuber thumbnail uh, art right here. <laughs> it's pretty jokes. So here's a closer look at the uh, Cyrus boss's orders. And I gotta say, I can, I can definitely find this card really easily in my deck. That's one of the main reasons a lot of people like to play full art cards or better rarity cards of specific ones in their deck so that you can find, find them and, and search them out of your deck quicker. And uh, having a full art boss with orders like this will make it really easy to see uh, on my initial deck search if I have this specific card in my deck available to me. It's not like pay to win, but it is a strategy a lot of people like to employ. If they have one to two ofs, uh, they'll just get a, a nice blinged out version of the card so it's easy to find. There's the one copy of boss's orders that comes in everybody's uh tournament premium collection box and then we have three different uh extra copies of boss's orders but this time it has the cosmo foil pattern which is similar to uh the you know the, fo the, the foil pattern we were growing up with back in the day with the first couple of eras and then uh if you actually pull this card in a set it has a different sort of hollow foil. So I'll have a comparison on screen right now. You guys can see on the left, we have the promo. And then on the right, we have the one that you can pull. You get a full playset. A playset is considered four copies of the card. So we got one nice blinged out full art version and then three of these really nice versions. You're also gonna get a code card too, which will give you all four of these bosses orders in the online game. And they also include a jumbo coin featuring Cyrus as well with this cool shattered ice rainbow kind of look to it. It. Now it's time to get to the booster packs inside. So I believe you get seven packs in total and the pack selection should all be quite similar or all the same for all of these boxes. But we're going to find out uh, when we open up the Clara and the other boss's orders box or boss's orders, other Cyrus box. We got some zoom in action there as well. You also get these really cool poison and burn counters or markers. These are sick. I actually really, really like these. They went for a cool design on them. Seven booster packs in total. We got Brilliant Stars, Fusion Strike, Silver Tempest, Silver Tempest, Silver Tempest, Astral Radiance, and Astral Radiance. So we'll save Brilliant Stars for last. Maybe we can pull a Charizard, do some Charizard hunting for the last pack. And we got one pack of Fusion Strike as well. So let's start with the Fusion Strike. And if you are new to the channel, you're gonna absolutely wanna check out the Fusion Strike God Box that we opened up. I've been accused so many times of rigging those packs and resealing those packs. So you can be the judge. If you can prove that that video is faked, I'll give you $10,000, no problemo. And uh, yeah, just check it out. Fusion Strike, Error, God Box. Here we go, Fighting Energy, Stantler, Gliscor, Santa Scorch, Totodile, 
Boonery, Clobopus, Tynamo, Zorua, Slugma, and a Corviknight non-hollow. So no error pack right there. We got the Palkia pack art. Let's do the Palkia pack art first. And I'm excited, man, because this Friday is going to be uh, the first post-rotation tournament for us at the shop at Manta. Uh, rotation doesn't officially happen till like April 14th, but we're doing it a bit early at Manta because Manta is a very competitive store. And we have a lot of high caliber players who need some practice for EUIC, the European International Championship. So uh, we have a little earlier rotation at Manta and a camera that does not want to seem to focus. We got Yuxi, Bergmite, Rufflet, Ponyta, Chatot, Bronzor, a Golduck, and a Thievil. Thievil. This one is one of the most common, like, non hollows I keep pulling. I would like to pull a Dialga. I accidentally sold one of my Dialgas. Now I need another Dialga V. So if we could pull a Dialga V, I'll be happy with that because I am planning to build a uh, Dialga V Star deck. And I'll actually be doing a video uh, once rotation hits where it's going to be basically showing you guys the six decks I plan to start playing with for post rotation so you guys can see what I'm working with. And I'll, you also have access to my list if you want to test out the decks online. Here we go, Astral Radiance, second pack. We got Trekking Shoes Reverse Hollow, love to see it. And a Hisuian Lilligant V, a nice little 50 cent bulk card we're gonna trade in. All right, we got three packs of Silver Tempest up next. Let's start with the Reggie Drago pack art first. Can we pull a third alternate art Lugia V? I would love that, and uh, if we do, oh my gosh, I am just, I'm never gonna touch Silver Tempest again after that, because that means all my luck is gone from Silver Tempest. All right, we got Togedemaru, Swirlix, Marini, Indeedy, Chimeco, and a Talonflame. All right, let's do the Lugia pack art next up. And uh, if you guys haven't bought any Scarlet and Violet yet, you might want to think about it soon because quantities for art for Scarlet and Violet are really, really limited. Uh, Manta is actually like pretty much sold out uh, already of Scarlet and Violet. They did a midnight release, which was really cool. And uh, yeah, man, it, it really is incentive now to pre-order uh, because the amount of stock stores are getting is quite low. We got Clink and a Reshiram V, another 50 cent bulk card. Silver Tempest last round and then on to the Charizard for some Charizard hunting. One, two, three, four, and here we go. We got a Psychic Energy. Hypno, this dude, this Hypno is so creepy. So freaking creepy. We got Honchcrow, Ninetales, Krogunk, Solosis, Zubat, Elgium, Fungus, Fanfi, Reverse Hollow, and a Archaeops Hollow Rare. Hey, nice, nice, nice. Love to see it. Last pack of the video, Brilliant Stars. Can we pull H Charizard, man? And the Archaeops, I'm probably gonna use uh, because I am gonna play a Silver, Silver Strike, Single Strike Tyranitar and Lugia deck, so that should be fun. But here we go. Last pack magic of the video. We got a Dark Energy, Starmie, Fresh Water Set, Sigalif, a Cub Chew, Dedene, Farfetch. Nice, I needed this. I'll take this to the side for my uh, my Oinkaloink, Oinkaloink deck. Grimer, Milsery, and a Raikou V. All right, not bad at all. Click on screen right now to check out the Fusion Strike God Box, and I'll catch you guys in that video. Peace out.